every Namibian child should have access to quality education. Namibia should be leading in exporting know-how and expertise worldwide instead of raw material and resources that will run out. But how do we get there? Some of the most commonly encountered problems at our schools include overcrowded classrooms with overworked teachers that have very little time to spend with each individual learner. Conventional solutions include educating more teachers and building new or bigger classrooms. However, limited resources make this approach unsustainable. Therefore, a group of ambitious Namibians, the Dollar Learn and Table Team, and two equally ambitious schools, Berg Op Academy and Faith Primary, partnered with the world leaders in education, the Finnish, specifically Polar Partners and University Properties of Finland, to bring us closer to fulfilling our Namibian dream. Effectively integrating and using technology in our learning and teaching environments can improve the quality of our education and get Namibian learners ready to deal with the complex needs of today and tomorrow. The current global health crisis has shown that we need to urgently set up structures to fast-track e-learning in Namibia. E-learning can help our schools to move from a teacher-dependent to a more pupil-centered approach by allowing learners to advance and engage at their own pace using technology. E-learning focuses on uh, mathematic games and English exercise. Basically, the future tomorrow is digital and therefore e-learning will play a major role in education. They are eager to learn, so it makes it more fun, it makes it more interesting, and the learners actually want to go to the computer room and, and, and see what level and what percentage they get. It's like immediate satisfaction that they get. They don't have to wait for the teacher to mark the work, and they don't have to wait for their scores to come out. As soon as they do something, they actually get an immediate well done or uh, better ne luck next time. We are looking at e-learning as a really powerful tool to support and to augment the learning that is already happening in the classroom. What is really important to us in this project is that it's not about the technology or the devices. They in themselves are not a solution, but rather how the teachers and learners can use these to support their learning. We're excited to be piloting two e-learning solutions. One is called EduTen, which is a math online game essentially, a gamification of the math syllabus and curriculum. And the second software is called Me Hack It, which essentially teaches kids coding and software programming through music. Since we have started with the project and one, when we got the um, tablets, it, it helped the kids well because most of them never knew computers. They only know phones. But now that we have those, the few that we got, I think the kids are now getting to know them. We taught them how to operate. Before I think a lot of students fell asleep. <laughs> They were bored and they were zoned out and they were like staring out the window. But uh, when we started to in integrate e-learning and they could see things on video, they could see it in front of them. They, um, you could add 3D videos, you could add other problems, you could let them be active in the lesson as well through playing a game or doing anything or programming something. So it made it a lot more fun, it made it more challenging for them as well. So the skilled learners will never be bored and the ones that are, um, it takes a bit longer for them, they need extra help but they also get extra help on a different level with the e-learning. Well, it felt weird at first working with our technology because it's such a, nobody really uses it but like now we started using it so it's something new, exciting to do. As in, like before we just walk in the class, pen and paper and now we look forward to it. And now when we got the tablet, I know how to use a computer because before I didn't. I know how to do a lot of things, how to log in, how to create an email. I know how to do all those things. I like the tablets because they teach us things we never knew before. Some learners did not even know how to type or do their emails or take photos. I'm not good in mathematics at all, but when I got the tablets, it became easier. The Dolo Learn project looked to progressive solutions that could be implemented at Namibian schools. From the e-learning pilot done at Namibian schools, it is very clear that in order to progress towards digital learning, the right kind of support and teacher training is absolutely essential. 
Without the right expertise and training, a push toward e-learning could easily result in large capital expenditure in equipment and infrastructure with a very low return on investment, or simply put, ICT equipment collecting dust. The Dollar Learn project results show, however, that informed investment towards e-learning with professional training and support does open up a new world of learning opportunities and online education that can be implemented in a short period of time.